All right. Yeah, where, what the heck? What's going on? Why, why, why is it on your butt? Hold on. Something's going on. Um. Let me unplug this. Hey, <laughs> Zaya. Alright, it must have been the controller. Am I getting controller drift? I don't know. Maybe. Alright. Let's start this over. Um, where are we? Let's, uh, look at our journal. Zaid, the Prince of Revenge. I think that's the last one we have to recruit, right? Stop the collectors. No, 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 the convict too. Jack. I don't know who this guy is. Alright, well... No. I don't even know who this person is. Alright, get out of here. We're gonna go to the convict. Um, Jack, no last name, no. Exceptional biotic ability. No, criminal background, currently in custody. Jack is rumored to be the most powerful human biotic ever encountered. Um, oh, is it? Okay, yeah, that's right. Very little additional data regarding Jack is available, except that the subject has a history of violence and should be approached carefully. Currently, Jack is being held on the Turian prison ship Purgatory, Cerberus is negotiated for the prisoner's release. Let's do it. Alright, um, I don't know where we have to go, though. <sighs> Am I gonna need... fuel? Have you ever, like, run out of fuel? I need to know, in case I run out of fuel. Mash relay, okay. Alright, so it's the Zaid. Recruit the convict. Let's go over here. Um there we go. Prison ship. Alright. We're gonna dock. Oh, uh, we're gonna... I kind of like Kasumi. I'm gonna bring her with. Alright, let's see. Oh, I have points. Barrier. We're gonna... Oh, I need three points for barrier. Fine. Alright, whatever. Ah, okay. Because I'm pretty sure I'm going to run out of uh, fuel at some point. I don't know where he is. He should be around. He might be running late. Okay. Hey, Matt Nui. Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped and you can claim it shortly. As this is a high security vessel, you'll need to relinquish your weapons before we proceed. Uh, no. No. I can't do that. Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kirill, and this is my ship. Your weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. I'm not surrendering my gun. Period. Uh oh. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. We're bringing Jack out of cryo. As soon as the fund's clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to out-processing for the pickup, Commander. Let's go. Well. Cell block two. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. What is this? 
Each prisoner's cell is a self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. We house thousands of criminals. We can put the whole place in lockdown on a moment's notice. Nothing goes wrong here. Huh. I don't know. This place seems a little... It's a little much. Can you tell me about Jack? Cerberus hasn't told you? Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. Dangerous, crazy, and very powerful. You'll see soon enough. Can I romance him? <laughs> okay, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm totally going with Garrus. <laughs> you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin. Her? I got sick of seeing mm. criminals okay. escape out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Eventually, I'm not picky. I hit upon this idea. Keep the criminals in space and the galaxy is a safer place. Okay. Uh. You do this because you think it's necessary? Every day I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft, unwilling to make the hard choices. Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. Hey, Jolt. I'm feeling better. I'm getting there. Not 100% yet, but every day is a little bit better. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. We can cut corners that governments can't, and each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. These individuals are violent, and their home planets pay well to keep them here. Hey, BB-10. I was wondering where you were. <laughs> I knew it was a Mass Effect Friday and there was no way you were going to miss this. What happens if the home world doesn't want to pay? We explain that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help. So we'll be forced to release him back onto his home world. Oh. At an unspecified place and time. So it's an extortion racket. Pretty much. You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people and I'm keeping them locked up. Yeah, but, uh, that's kind of, uh, yeah. All right. Let's get on with this. Have there been escape attempts? We're in space. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. We have many ways to control the population. I'm going to confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Out processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the Supermax wing. Ooh. Supermax. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. Well then. Alright, so what are we doing? Can I talk to this guy? No. I need more renegade points. Ooh. Is there something I can do for you? There's no excuse for beating a prisoner who can't fight back. This is a massage compared to what his victims went through. <sighs> really? This degrades you as much as him. We have orders. You're not important enough to make your own decisions? I admit, I sometimes get tired of this. Does this really get us anything useful? Stop this. For your own sake. Yeah, you're right. Call it off. At least for now. Nope. But I need more renegade points! Um, did she introduce herself? I don't think so. Hey. Hey guys, over here. Let me ask you something. If you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? Man, I, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's gotta be better than this. We're here for Jack. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go nowhere with you. <laughs> oh shit, really? Um... So, what are you in for? I killed a few people. Only about 20 or so. Only? And I blew up that one habitat. Small time compared to most of the guys here. Really? <laughs> okay. I thought this ship was a prison, not a market. Sometimes people buy cons so they can do some punishing of their own, if you understand. Warden sells this to whoever can pay enough. This is a... Uh, this guy is making... Uh, okay. Tell me about Jack. 
me more about Jack. The worst trouble you ever saw. Mixed with some crazy and way too much biotic power. That's all I'm saying. What's it like here? Bad. And you gotta watch out. Damn, but someone's always after your stuff. Your smokes, clothes, your pride. Oof. I haven't taken a shower in three months. Oof. Why are they interrogating that prisoner? He knows something? Nah, that's Bimmy. He don't know nothing. He offed someone in the showers yesterday, I think. Guy he killed was worth a lot to the warden. Yeah. Sucks to be Bimmy right now. They're going at it pretty hard. Do they ever kill prisoners by accident? I haven't heard of anyone dying. Warden can't make money off us if we're dead. Funny thing, though. The more a guard does it, the meaner he gets. So they rotate him through. Huh. I should go. Wish I could go. <sighs> I don't like this place. Um, yeah. Blue... blue. Sons. Oh, another prisoner. I hear the screaming in my head. It's nice. Yeah. Okay, no, not you. Now processing is through the door on the far side of the room. Huh, what's this other way? This is the supermax wing. It's off limits. Out processing is back down the hall on your right. Uh, we're gonna be getting in there. After the cryo thaw is finished. I know we're we're gonna get into supermax, and then we're gonna have to kill a bunch of people, because just that's just the way it is. Why even bring up supermax and everything without you know us going there? You're more valuable as a prisoner than a customer. What? Drop your weapons and proceed into this open cell. You will not be harmed. Okay. <laughs> really? Uh. You talked up your noble intentions with this prison, but it turns out you're a criminal like the rest. Activate systems. All right. Uh. I forgot to hide. Shit! How do I hide? <laughs> Crap. Wait, um, somebody help! I forgot how to play! Oh my god. What was, what was my cover button? <laughs> Alright, y'all, oh, I'm trying. Ah! Alright, hold on. Oh. Poppycorns? No, I don't know what he has. Alright, now how do I cover again? No, hold on. Ah, let's see, key bindings. Uh, E. Ah, there we go. Then stay down. There we go. Uh Uh. Oh. 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 
Alright. Those doggos aren't even, like, living. They're just, like, robots. Robot doggos. Shepard is on the loose. Repeat, Shepard is loose. Get people down here. Yeah, that's what you get for selling me out. Shepard, if you hack that control, every door on the cell block opens. It's the only way to get Jack out of there. I'm doing it. Be ready. Yes. No. Oh my god, put on a shirt. We have to get down there. All right. Uh are there anything to open? Let's see. Element 0. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, where'd she go? <coughs> I'll take it. All guards, restore order. Lethal force authorized. But don't kill Jack. Text lockdown. Lockdown. Sector seven. Nine and eleven have lost life support. No survivors. That's fine. This place this place needs to go down in a blaze of glory. Sad. Oh my shotgun. They should be easy to track. I can't I can't get down. I can't it, I can't get up. Hack. Um why why am I stuck here? Scratch one. Understood. Gotcha. Well. That's not working. Going silent. Damn, can this guy just like die already? All right. There, finally did it. Uh oh. Yeah, I did that, I think, last stream. Alright, that's it. I think this is the last squad mate that I hate to. working. Uh. Oh, thank goodness. Warning. Power plant damage has led to overload. Core systems failure. Wait, imminent. there's a pod? <laughs> I don't know what you guys are talking about. <laughs> yes. 
guard got swarmed by prisoners with improvised weapons. <coughs> never had a chance. It shows you what kind of people these prisoners are. I don't agree with everything they do here, but it's in the galaxy's best interests. This guard kept maniacs away from innocent people. Okay, but the ends don't always justify the means, Garrus. Alright, let's go. Oh. Oh, that guy. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, in my defense, I actually had to get a lot of shit done that day because it was right before my party on Saturday. So, uh, yeah, that's why. I'll go look into it when we get back. Heal my squad? How do I heal my squad? Flashbang, Shadow Strike. Shields have failed. Uh. Alright, hold on. I need that. Going side. Oh. There we go. Achievement. Oh, I, <laughs> I, I shot him in the leg. Oh my god. Okay. They they do feel better. Yeah, it's cheeseman.
Uh oh. You're valuable, Shepard. I could have sold you and lived like a king. But you're too much trouble. At least I can recapture Jack. Not happening. You're a two bit slave trader, and I don't have time for it. I do the hard thing civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. Okay. Okay. Where the heck did he go? What is going on with that? Oh, there he is. Filthy so and so. Oh, that's not him. That's just somebody else. So, uh, wait, hold on, I, there was a, uh, there it is, Shh, warden, we have to kill this guy? You in there? There's shields, we gotta take these shields out, I think. Oops. There we go. Wait! That was Garrus. <laughs> I was trying to shoot you, Garrus. I'm sorry. It's a good thing that, uh... Oh shit, you're invincible. Alright, now we gotta get this fucker. Where is he? There's a path there. Pretty much. Oh, do we do it? No. Cerberus. Some rage issues. What the hell do you want? I just saved your ass. He was already dead. He just didn't know it. Now, what the hell do you want? <sighs> My name is Shepard, and I'm here to get you off this ship. I'm not going anywhere with you. You're Cerberus. Why does it matter if I'm with Cerberus? They've been on my ass for years. Anytime I get free, they put a huge bounty on me. That's why Warden Curl figured he'd struck gold when he caught me. It isn't working out too well for him. Uh... I'm here to ask for your help. Can you show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere? You think I'm stupid? Yes? No. The ship is going down in flames. We can get you to safety, and we're asking for your help. We could knock her out and take her. 
I'd like to see you try. Yeah, maybe we should. It might just come to that. You'll have to kill me. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. Tell me what you're thinking. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. Eh, fine. I'll give you full access. You better be straight up with me. So why the hell are we standing here? Move out. Okay. Woo. We get a level up. Um, shotgun damage. All right, let's go. I gotta go blow my nose, so sorry, guys. I need tissues. I'll be right back. Uh oh, is this a cutscene? Damn it, it's a cutscene. Welcome to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow orders. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. <sighs> yeah, she's right. Miranda will let you into the system. Let me know what you find. Hear that, Precious? We're going to be friends. You, me, and every embarrassing little secret. I'll be reading down in the hold, or somewhere near the bottom. I don't like a lot of through traffic. Keep your people off me. Better that way. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, all right, now I blow my nose. Ugh. Oh, uh, sorry if I'm like sort of stuff in, in in your guys' ears. I can't help it. Here, let me take another uh, Ricola. Yeah, I need a tissue. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I just I feel like it's gonna be weeks of me like coughing and hacking and. Stuff. Ugh. Ugh. Alright, so I gotta find this pod, right? Where the hell is the pod? Hmm. Shepard, the tank you recovered from Corliss indicates stable Krogan life signs inside. It is in the cargo bay, should you wish to investigate. Nice. The, the, the cargo bay? Engineering, maybe? Yeah. Just exactly what I needed to know where that damn tank was. Engineering. There we go. Ugh, I want to talk to you. There we go. The subject is stable, Shepard. Integration with onboard systems was seamless. Ooh. Can he see anything in there? Does he know where he is? Unlikely. Current neural patterns indicate minimal cognition. Barring shipwide power loss, the nutrients in the tank could sustain him for over a year. Any idea how dangerous this guy is? He is a Krogan, Shepard. If you were asking whether he is actively hostile, I don't have the necessary data to answer. Okir's technology could impart data, not methods of thinking. The subject may know of his views, but would not necessarily share them. What can you tell me about this guy? Anything unusual? The subject is an exceptional example of the Krogan species, with fully formed primary, secondary, and tertiary organs where applicable. No defects of any kind, aside from the genetic markers of the genophage present in all Krogan. I cannot judge mental functioning. Alright, open it. Stand by. 
I'm gonna open the tank and let him out. Cerberus protocol is very clear regarding untested alien technology. Nah, he's too valuable. No, you know what? Just do it, do it, Edie. I won't be second guessed on my own ship by my own ship. Do it. Very well, Shepard. The controls are online. The switch and consequences are yours. <laughs> wow. It's, she's not really a, she's a, a, a computer. I hope this was a mistake. Mistake. Human, female. Before you die, I need a name. I'm Commander Shepard, and I don't take threats lightly. I suggest you relax. Not your name. Mine. I'm trained. I know things. But the tank, Okir couldn't implant connection. His words are hollow. Warlord, legacy, grunt. Grunt. Grunt was among the last. It has no meaning. It'll do. I am Grunt. If you are worthy of your command, prove your strength and try to destroy me. Grunt? Well... You wouldn't prefer Okir or the Legacy? It's short. Matches the training in my blood. The other words are big things I don't feel. Maybe they fit your mouth better. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. I'll do what I'm bred to do. Fight and determine the strongest. But his imprint has failed. Without a reason that's mine, one fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. All right. Yeah, my command is your reason. I think that's a good one. Let's just go with it. I took you and I released you. Follow my command and you'll have purpose. Nothing in the tank imprints indicated humans could be so forceful. You command as though you've earned it. My enemies threaten galaxies. Everyone on my ship has earned their place. Hmm. Hmm. That's acceptable. I'll fight for you. I'm glad you saw reason. Huh? <laughs> Offer one hand but arm the other. Why, Shepard? If I find a clan, if I find what I, I want, I will be honored to eventually pit them against you. Really? Okay. There, some renegade points. Shepard. What are your thoughts about our mission? I fight. Doesn't matter who for. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. Humans talk too much. Like the tank. Come back later. Did Okir give you any imprints about the Collectors? I see blurry ships. Guesswork about strength. Nothing to help pick a weak spot and tear. Okir spent all his time on old hatreds. Whatever he had, it was used up when he made me. Hmm. Upgrades. Anything in your tank imprints that can make use of the resources we found? Hmm. Might have something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. Ooh. Um. Hmm. Definitely want that. All right, whatever. Ooh, a broken shotgun. Shepard. Let's go see some, in some more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Might have some. Armor upgrades. Let's see. Emergency shielding trauma module. Hmm. I need more. Oh, I don't have. Yeah, I do have cash. Uh. <laughs> Oh man, unit restores squad members shields. Of I need more cash. Oh, I should keep this crap around. Don't let it pile up. I live down here. That's all for now. Shepard. All right.
Whatever. Resources. Um. Where's Jack? I hear that Rupert is actually cooking some good meals lately. Yeah, right. That scunner couldn't serve a good haggis if his life depended on it. But all haggis taste like ass anyway. Aye, but in the right hands, it can taste like my You really want me to be scanning planets all the time? Oh my god, I don't want to sit here and scan planets. I want to shoot stuff and I want to romance aliens. That's what I want to do. I tried doing it, but I don't think the mod works. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. If they're helping you, that's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. You need me to kill for you, I need you for these files. Let's leave it there. Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. I'm looking for names, dates, places. What happens when you find what you're looking for? I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. The galaxy's gonna be a lot emptier when I'm done. I won't let you go on a killing spree. I'm here for your mission. After that, what I do is my business. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. And they've been chasing me ever since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. You think about this a lot, don't you? I go to sleep with this. I wake up with it. Everyone I kill, I pretend it's the ones that did this to me. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. You know, this ship is a powerhouse. You could go pirate. Live like a queen. I could help. We have to stop the collectors. I don't have time for piracy. When this is done, we'll either be dead or out here in space with this ship. Think about it. Lots of creds. Freedom to go wherever you want. And all the mayhem and fighting I could want. <sighs> what is it about killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, my chances of survival go up. Simple. I should go. Yep. Alrighty then. Um. Let's see. Oh, all right, all right. So what you're saying is I got to go explore planets. I don't want to explore planets. Oh. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. What? Where's the debriefing room? Encrypted transmission transmission from the elusive man Shepard I see you awakened Dokir's Krogan a dangerous decision but you've got free reign on this operation if you're certain he'll be a useful member of the team you've got my support we need every weapon we can we can in this battle if this grunt proves unreliable it has to be shut down don't lose the body he's based at least partially on collector technology and could offer useful genetic data but again you are in charge really until I'm not Entitled error, invalid sender name. Hey Shepard, heard I have you to thank for getting out of purgatory. Sent a ship to round me up, but they didn't weapons check good enough. I'm gonna carve your name instead of mine into my next victim as thanks. Got anyone you need dead? <laughs> you did take a shot at me, though, on my way out, so I have to kill you. You know how it goes. Dad taught me that you let anybody hurt you, they get ideas, so you make sure to send a message. Not like I'm sending now. Not like I'm sending now, though. See you around, the people who live. Wait. The people who live here are coming back, and it's showtime. Look around for your name. 
I'll make sure you find it before I fight you, Billy. I don't even remember who this person is. I don't even know who you are. <sighs> Things are quiet again. From Omega Clinic Desk. Commander, I wanted to thank you again for saving me from those Batarians. I thought I'd seen the worst of people's anger and fear at Dr. Solis's clinic. I had no idea how much anger this work was keeping in check. How bad it really was. If not for you, I'd be dead. Thank you. The clinic is doing well. You got rid of the, uh, most of the plague, and I've been able to handle the rest without too much trouble. The Blue Suns keep offering to take over security here. I keep the mechs powered on. I won't make the same mistake twice. Thanks. Dan. I think I read that one last week. Oh. Alright. So where is the, um... Let's see. Jack's tattoos are beautiful. As colorful as her past, I'm sure. I have concerns with her temper, though. Yeah, she's crazy. I'll do my best not to piss her off. Please warn me if you fail. I want a chance to hide. Anyway, how many <coughs> are you, Commander? Ugh. Oh. Hold on. My ears are popping. Oh, sorry guys. I know it sounds disgusting. But I can't. I can't. Yeah, I'm popping out my eardrums. It's not fun. Ugh. Oh, too much pressure. Alright, let's get out of here. I'll be here if you need anything. Yeah, I have floppy eardrums. It's not fun. Uh, let's see. The elusive man wants to talk to me. Where do I do that? Hmm. Let's see. one Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the terminus systems just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morton delivered the countermeasure for the seeker swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams. She's stationed on Horizon. What? The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew. I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you. Especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. Hmm. Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Perhaps you should take it up with her. All right. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Tell me you have something. Uh. Yes. Are you really over there already? Lilith, 
We've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. What is that? Uh, what is that? Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you. Run! Uh oh. Wait, she's frozen. You know what we need? They need a um flamethrower. So I'm guessing it paralyzes them so that the collectors can come and take them and round them up. Yep. I think that's what's happening. BB-10, this entire game is full of aliens. Uh-oh. on this one. Alright, I got two points. I can't use them on anything. I don't care about incendiary ammo. Let's see this. Nothing. What? Why are you screaming at me? I know. I'm so mad the game doesn't have an equip best. Just give me a quick bass, please. Alright, okay, here we go. We're ground side. Morden, you sure those armor upgrades will protect us from the seeker swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers should confuse detection make us invisible to swarms. In theory. In theory? That sounds promising. Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Look forward to seeing if you survive. Oops. This should slow him down. Eris, out of the way. Oh my god, I can't see anything. I'll put them down. about 
Alright, so... Where are we going? I think we got them all! Uh, swarm. Collectors are disrupting communications. We're on our own now. The heck was that? They've got heavies. Well, you're my heavy grunt. Look like the husks that Geth used on Eden Prime. I thought yeah, they had got that technology from Sovereign. Then your elusive man was right. Collectors must work for the Reapers. No more targets. Huh. <sighs> Ooh, research data. Sort of looks human. This one of the colonists? No. The Geth impaled their victims on giant spikes to turn them into husks. But we haven't seen any. The collectors must have already had the husks. They want the colonists alive for something else. Hmm. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They still die when you shoot them. Collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Maybe it's better not to know the details. Guess we'll find out when we stop them. The collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Yeah. Red just wants to kill shit. Your people. These empty buildings. It's unsettling. Turned around. Damn it. Firing a high impact shot. All right, I'm getting the safe. <laughs> you uh, do what you're going to do there, Garrus. Of course I gotta get the shinies. I need more monies and materials or shit to, to upgrade.
looks like some type of stasis field. Leaves victims helpless, but fully aware. They've been like this a long time. The heck? You guys hear that? I'm pretty sure that was a car. I didn't think I actually felt it. Oops. Oops. Damn it. Damn it. I'm not gonna get it. There we go. Objective is that way. Nice work. We didn't do anything, <laughs> but I'll take the uh, the accolades. My genetic what the what? Destiny. Because of shot ready. You cannot resist. What? Are you going to assimilate us? Collector particle beam acquired. The following squad members are now able to use this weapon. Shepard. Okay. It is easy. I'm not. You know what? I'm not. I'm not in this for the gameplay. I'm in this for the alien romance. Like seriously, you guys should know be better. Okay. Strangle me better. Okay. No, I'm in it for the story. That's okay. As long as it happens. Company. Get out here. Now. You're you're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here! I cleared a path. You're lucky you're not in the hold of a collector ship right now. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of... bugs. 
Everyone they touch just froze. I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Uh, I don't know about that. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Chief Williams? Heard she was some kind of hero or something. Didn't mean nothing to me, though. Would have rather she just stayed back in council space. Any idea what she was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling she was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. <sighs> Tell me about the colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. Uh, <laughs> I I was not a fan of Kaiden. Um let's see. Yeah, I don't there's really nobody else in here that I'm interested in. I could go for for Liar again, but no, no, no. We all know who my heart belongs to. Why do you think this is the alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left council space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. The Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said she was just here to get the towers online, but mark my words, there's more to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you have defenses, we can use them against the Collector ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. One of us should be able to figure it out. We just need the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Not a chance in hell. <laughs> yes, I'm so excited. You guys don't even know how excited I am about that romance. Uh, fine. Stay here. You'd probably just get in the way. He'd die. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. If I took this okay. guy with him, I'd probably shoot him on an accident. It. Yeah, I would shoot him on an accident. So who's the uh, best male chef uh, romance in this? Enemies on our Miranda, right. probably. I don't know. I know Chusman likes Miranda, but who's like the other than that? I will direct this personally. My attacks will tear you apart. This guy just keeps fucking coming. Ah! Shit! Where the fuck there? The logistics for not getting her sick? Uh oh. What the hell is that? What the hell is that thing? Oh my god. It was like a zombie or something. This should come in handy. How come we don't see more frozen people around? Probably loaded onto the collector ship by now. We should hurry. Um.
Um, I need more uh, ammo. Thank you. Ugh! Alright, here we go. Heck is that thing? What are these scions? <laughs> so oh shit, sorry. Oh crap. Um Ow! Get up off of me! See no transmitters. Uh. This thing? Oh, you this thing that says computer. Normandy, do you copy? Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Um... Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. The collectors will try to stop it. Did you hear that, BB-10? She said Edie. She didn't say EDI. She said ED. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. All right. What? Assuming control of this form. Look out! Ah. Leave the dead where they fall. No, I didn't say. My attacks will tear you apart. You know what? My attacks will tear you apart. You cannot resist. Will you shut up? Or your genetic destiny. Ow! Hold on. I didn't see EDI. I said ED. How do I heal? Oh. Nothing stands against us. Bypassing fail safes and attempting emergency power up. Please hold a defense tower. I'm a trying. I'm a trying. I'm a little excited about that. <sighs> Sequential power up. Initiated. Guardian anti ship batteries at 40%. More coming. I guess we got our attention. Assuming direct 
Firing a high impact shot. My attacks will tear you apart. Let's see. All right, are we almost done with this? I didn't realize we'd be doing tower defense. Got to be more soon. Ah, there we go. Nope. Monster. What is that? What in the fuck? All right, here we go. We need that system online. Ow! Get too close. batteries at hundred percent. I have control. I'll put them down. All right, I'm running out of stuff. The Praetorian? Yes. <laughs> You're like that. This is killing you watching me play it on easy. Uh, There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something. I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. It was a good fight, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard. Captain of the Normandy. The first human specter. Savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan. Back from the dead. What? Oh, the good people we lost and you get left behind. <laughs> Screw this. I'm done with you Alliance types. I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. Well... <sighs> it's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? I would have followed you anywhere, Commander. I thought you were gone. I... You were more than our Commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? Well, we weren't like that. <sighs> Not my choice. I spent the last two years in some kind of coma while Cerberus rebuilt me. You're with Cerberus now? Garrus, too? I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? You mean you already knew? Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. We got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. It's uh, awkward if you romance Ashley. Yeah, I'd be like, yeah, and I'm, I'm already with somebody else. Um. Building the defense towers was just a cover story. The Alliance sent you here to investigate me, didn't they? I was sent here to investigate Cerberus, not you. I wanted to believe you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. She seems a little spurned. You know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. 
You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? What if they're the ones working with the Collectors? Damn it, Williams. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're ignoring the real threat. You mean, when he said, until death do us part, that really happened? Um... You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of the facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. Join me! Come on, let's go! I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. That'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being extremist. I'll never work for a group like that. Alright, see ya. So long, Commander. Bye. Good luck. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. <sighs> Ooh. Level up. Uh oh. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully, the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. Hmm. I enjoyed the fight. I don't know. Maybe should I say that? I need some Renegade points. It was good to finally go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the enemy. Now you've got a taste for it. I'll be sure to find a way to keep you sated. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. I don't like looking that closely at his skin. Um... I wondered if you had something to do with that attack. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. I released a few carefully disguised rumors that you might be alive and working for Cerberus. I see. What were you trying to prove? I suspected the Collectors were looking for you or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. It was a risk, but I couldn't just wait for them to take another colony. You understand? Uh... What's our next step? We have to keep the pressure on the Collectors. They'll be more cautious with their ground operations. So we need another opening. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? Eh. Yeah, I guess. It was hard to see Ashley again. And now it's done. Best to leave those connections behind and focus on our mission. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Uh. I'll make sure they're ready, one way or the other. The Collectors won't know what hit them. I trust you know what you're doing. I just want to be clear about your odds. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. Three more careful, dossiers? Shepherd. The collectors will be watching you. We're getting more peoples? I guess we're really gonna do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Take the fight to the collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. Hmm. I need you sharp and focused if we're gonna get this done, Taylor. That's what I meant, Commander. I don't want any distractions when we hit the relay. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? You know, Jacob is smooth. I can tell. He's a smooth mofo. But no. I can't romance him. Garrus is my heart. Okay.
Alright, I gotta go, like, look at planets and shit. I'm not- look! How was that loot? I said he's smooth! Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. That's it. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hackett, Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. Thane, I like the, 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 the sound of that name. It sounds mysterious. Thank you for your time. I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. So why call me? Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. <sighs> What's Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. I'd heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. Hmm. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and Alliance agent working in Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her run away in a Batarian torture camp. <sighs> Fine. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. The Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. Uh-huh. Fine. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground and a Batarian outpost in Aratat. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hack it out. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do that one just yet. Oh, is this DLC? Okay, well, I'm not going to worry about that one right now. I should go around talking to people. Hold on. my quarters. Let's start from the bottom up. So, Kenneth, did you know we've got a crazy woman squatting down in the subdeck? What? If she touches anything, I'll kill her. Oh, and the only thing she wears from her waist up is tattoos. Oh, maybe I should go down and welcome her at home. <laughs> She's a murderer, has biotic powers that could crush you with a blink, hates everyone in Cerberus. Damn it, girl, stop toying with me. <laughs> what can we do for you, Commander? Uh, we already did all this. Never mind. Carry on. Will do, Commander. Hey. What do you think of Miranda and Jacob? Jacob doesn't know who he is, but that's not my problem. Miranda's a Cerberus bitch. Knew that before she opened her mouth. 
Tell me about you, Jack. What are you up to? Still checking out your ship. Wouldn't mind putting her through her paces when you're not around. If I take you too seriously, I might need to deal with you. Try it. Anyway, relax. Joyriding doesn't have the thrill it used to. Besides, if I wanted it, I'd take it. That's so... Uh, I've been around. Ran with gangs, wiped out some gangs, joined a cult. Kept the haircut. I learned how to survive and not be a victim. It's hard to imagine you in a cult. That usually involves a lot of rules. I was looking for answers. Drugs and sex and going to a better place. A better place, right. It was all about money. They wanted to take a colony, shake the suckers down to fund their spread, and guess who was their ace in the hole? They were just like the rest. Didn't give one shit about me. What'd you do when you found out? What do you think? Uh... You must have met some good people, too. Everybody wants something. And because of that, everything is fair game. Murder, assault, kidnapping, drugs, stealing, arson. Done it all. And that's the boring shit. Piracy, theft of military craft, destruction of a space station, and vandalism. That was a good one. Do you ever wonder if you could have done things differently? No. Shouldn't you? There's no reason I should be alive, but I am. You know why? Instinct. It's worked for me so far, and I'm not gonna change. Let's drop it, okay? Get back to whatever it is you think we can do. You can ask about the vandalism? Well, I don't know. She don't want to talk to me no more. Alright. Who else is down here? I don't like that guy. Watch this area of the ship. No, I don't want to hear it. Cargo deck. It includes facilities to rearm and repair. That's all for now. Shepard. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open. Not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo. Then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships, anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human info's floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Solarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. <laughs> he, just, uh, he just told a dad joke. Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. So you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Alright. Is there anybody else down here? I don't think so. What's wrong? I lost contact with Luke Canton. 
Might be the collectors. Did your family get out of there? I don't know. There's no communications yet. I'm sure they're safe. We'll see. Um, can I flush? I want to flush a toilet. <sighs> Why is there no shower curtain? Hey, got a minute? I really appreciate your help with the Hawk Heist. I've been going through Keiji's gray box. It's so nice to have him back. Even in that form, I miss him. Okay, you don't have much to say. Thank you, Commander. Rupert put the new supplies to good use. Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Oh. What's up? Randy, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. <sighs> Oh, I can drink at the bar? Yes! Okay. So why are you sharing the family history with me? My father's agents have been searching for my sister for years. I believe they've tracked her to Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical, but she deserves a normal life, and she's going to get it no matter what. So there is something she cares about. Did your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus, and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay. Alright, so that's her quest, I'm guessing. No, I did drink in Kasumi's, um, in her, uh, her room the other day. I did drink in there. I just didn't drink a lot, but I did drink. How can I help you, Commander? Do you have everything you need? Absolutely. Since you set up my kitchen with proper supplies, thanks again. Alright, see ya. I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibration. No, oh, for fuck's sake, Garrus! I'm trying to hit on you! Why do you keep t turning me away? Oh my god, he's playing hard to get! This is killing me! Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. <sighs> what? I, gotta, I need another tissue. I'll be right back. Sorry, when I talk a lot, I, I, I get all, you know how I get. That's not me hacking. That's not. Uh, that's Anixia. Anixia is hacking. I cut. 
No, whatever. My box of tissue in front of me would cover up like part, parts of my screen. Because, uh, uh, like, whatever. One choice? Yes! <laughs> also, why do I leave those angles? I don't mean to. At least I didn't leave it for the butt. Okay. Um, it's pretty big. I would tell you how big it is in inches, but you have no idea what inches are. Alright. How may I help you, Commander? Eh, nothing. I'll see you later, Doctor. Commander. <sighs> Access to the AI core is restricted. Tell you in Judas? Wait, there was something that I was watching the other day. No, no, no! This was at the party! Oh my god, this is the best. Alright, so Hugo decided that he was going to start measuring people in Pringles. And he went up to, I think he went up to um, Monty, and he like did his hands like, you know, measuring. And he's like, 22 Pringles big. <laughs> it was hilarious! And I'm like, oh my god, now we're using Pringles as a unit of measurement. <laughs> oh, it was hilarious. I had to tell you guys that one. Alright. Jacob wants to speak with you. Jacob. No, I'm definitely not just one Pringle big. Um Where the hell is Jacob? Let's see. Robin Reeve? The commander, or to the commander. The Alliance soldier here gave me this contact information. I hope this reaches you. You said you were trying to stop those collectors. They took my son and my brother. Have you found them? Do you know where they are? I know you're looking, but so many people are just gone. Every family lost someone. Children are the worst. Empty desks at the schools. Winter clothes that never got worn. Please, the Alliance isn't doing anything. The Council isn't doing anything. If you can find our people, I'm begging you to do something. Tell me something I can do. Tell me anything, Robin Reeve. Okay. Sorry. Uh, to Shepard from the Cerberus Information Process. We're aware that your old friend, Tiara T Liara Tassoni. Liara. Uh oh, this might be uh, awkward. Sorry, I gotta blow my nose again. I know it's gross, but you guys, I can't help it. Liara Tassoni has been hunting for the Shadow Broker for several years. We wouldn't mind helping her on that hunt, given the Broker's past work for the Collectors. We recently uncovered some information that might give Liara a lead on where to find the Shadow Broker's base of operations. But unfortunately, she doesn't have much faith, faith in Cerberus Intel. If you'd visit Ilium and pass it on to her as a gesture of goodwill, we'd appreciate it. This is going to be, uh, now me blowing my nose is going to be like on the internet forever, you know, you know, posterity, whatever. It's just too much. Ugh. You know, I, I don't even care anymore. It's not any more embarrassing than me falling on my ass drunk while streaming. Alright, where is Jacob? I don't remember where Jacob is. That was that was great. <laughs> I literally was on the floor trying to find the damn screw. <laughs> that was pretty good. But that still wasn't as good as my quiet man stream. Not as good as that one. There's Jacob. Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. I always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase, but... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. Hmm. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gernsback, the ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, 
reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I've buried everything but a body. I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. I'd think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Huh. I, rem I remember, honestly, I remember the big bottle of Jose Cuervo sitting on my desk and me taking shots. <laughs> that's what I remember from the, the, the Quiet Man's dream. Oh, let's see. Any signs that this is a Cerberus front? Who passed this to you? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like, well, you. And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for favors, or thought it would get under my skin. Who knows with that bunch? You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it. Even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Privately held frigate. I looked over the mission brief when it disappeared. Nothing stood out. Typical research and grab operation. Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence as you can as fast as possible to shut out competitors. Alright. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. Chewy, what are you doing, Boo Boo? Chewy is doing so much better. Like he was actually, uh, I, I took the laser pointer out and was trying to play with Nashu. He was running around like a kitten. I have not seen him chase the laser point <laughs> that like that and I can't remember how so long and now he he and, and Nashu are chasing each other around the house oh shit is, is Nashu still in the garage hold on I gotta go see Nashu come on you been in the garage no Chewie no 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 <laughs> <laughs> She's been in the garage for like two hours. Well, I remember um Chuz been going in there. I'd be like, nah, she was in there. <laughs> um, don't forget. <laughs> that was like ten minutes before I started my stream. <laughs> Alright. No, Chewy, I can't see chat. I can't Chewy, I can't see come here. Come here. <sighs> over here. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Alright, Chewie comes. He's on top of me now. Alright. So I'm guessing that's two new quests. Oh, choose. I can't see chat when... When you're sitting in the way. Oh my god, cat. He's got your his butt on you guys. I just want you to know his butt is sitting on chat. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Of course. Plague on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with a budget. AI in particular, very helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with Special Tasks Group. All right, hold on. I need to move Chad up. So <laughs> Damn it! I moved the chat up and he stood up. Now I can't read. 
See, you still can't read, you guys. Oh, my God. All right. You know what? Fine. You want to go in the garage? Come on. Come on. Go on. You go in there. Ah, oh, shit. All right, now I can't forget that he's in there. You said you were in the special tasks group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert, high risk, served under young captain named Kirihi. Studied Krogan genophage, took water, tissue samples from Krogan colonies. I worked with an STG captain named Kirihi. His team helped me destroy Saren's cloning facility on Burmeyer. Heard Kirihi died in Vermeer. Not enough equipment for operation. Still managed to take down facility. Good captain. Dedicated. Bit of a cloaca, though. Loved his speeches. Hold the line. Personally prefer to get job done and go home. <laughs> Probably military bravado. Jargon. Chest pounding. Uh, no offense. What can you tell me about the genophage? Bioweapon designed by Salarian science team. Deployed by Turians against Krogans to end Krogan rebellions more than a thousand years ago. Affects every cell of Krogan body. Commonly and incorrectly considered a sterility plague. Actually adjusts viable fertility rates to compensate for a high Krogan birth rate. Stabilizes to pre-industrial population growth levels. Okay. Hold on. Let me get the texts. Ah. <sighs> What? All right. Nice talking with you, Morden. I should get back to work. Need to study. So much data. Here if you need me. All right, fine, fine. All right. So we gotta go get um. No. Uh, wait, where's the elevator? Oh, here we are. All right. So I've got to go get some materials, it looks like. All right, so how do I do that? Unexplored. Let's see. I don't know what I'm supposed to Wait, how am I supposed to scan? Oh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to know if they're. Oh, says Rich. Probe away. In research projects, iridium is used to upgrade heavy weapons, submachine guns, and assault rifles. All right, fine. Saying Rich still. Probe away. <sighs> Probe launched. Oh, I didn't get anything. Launching probe. In research projects, platinum is used to upgrade sniper rifles, shotguns, and medical equipment. <sighs> this chart on the right. Oh, it's poor. Oh, that's high. Probe away. Pretty good. Probe away. Ah. 
All right, let's get out of here. No, I want to. What do you mean? Oh, cheating! Not me cheating. Because I don't cheat. Actually, that's all I I do. Ooh, Galactic Explorer. I know, how come we didn't get that mod working? <laughs> That's all I want. Just do the oop. Oops. Launched. No. This is tedious. Tedious. I didn't- oh my god. You were supposed to help me. Launching probe. other planets out here. Can I do this one? Let's see. Investigate Project Overlord. Recruit ta- <gasps> Re Recruit Tally?! I did, damn it! But you know what the problem is? This is freaking an EA. How many times am I supposed to scan a planet? There's so many quests. So... Oh, I don't know. How am I supposed to know these things? I never played this game in my entire life. Hold on, we're gonna go recruit Tally in a minute. Oh, this is rich. This is basically busy work. Launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Yeah, I think that that was a mix, yeah. Probe away. All right, after after the stream, I'm downloading the freaking mod. Launching One click, probe. completely get all of the resources and move on with my life. Launching probe. Probe. Who thought this was a good idea? Launching probe. <sighs> no, I mean the person who developed this game. Probe launched.
All right, that's enough. Let's go, um... Let's go, uh... Yeah, that's bullshit. I'd rather just not deal with it and have it be 30-hour gameplay. All right, um... I need a... Uh, yeah. Let's see. Damage protection. Ooh, emergency shielding. But, but I want them. Okay, let's see. Alright, trauma module. We're gonna do that one. Sniper, sniper rifle damage for sure. And then, yeah, we'll do that one. Uh, ooh, ship enhancements. Yeah, I can't do any of this yet. All right, well, we'll worry about that later. Um, are you telling me there's nothing to report? Alright. Alright. Who else we want? Oh, I got four points. I'm gonna use that on my barrier. Yep. Uh, ooh, killing intent is ever present, increasing weapon damage and storm speed and giving a damage bo bonus to powers. Okay. projector No, I don't think I like the arc projector. Hold on. Yeah. Uh I can't use that. Hmm. All right. Shepard, our data indicates the tally is somewhere in these ruins. There is considerable geth activity and an environmental hazard. Solar output has overwhelmed Astra's protective magnetosphere. Exposure to direct sunlight will damage your shields. So, don't stand in the sun. That's not fun. I'm having serious issues with my shields. And I'm wearing black. Can we get in the shade, please? I'm trying! Oh my god.
Sealed authorization from Kyle Rigar. Migrant fleet marines. Shit. Well, I don't I don't know. None of these guys have anything. There we go. Incoming dropship. You see that? <coughs> All right. something. Ah! Oh, this is fun. We should find an alternate path. We're roasting out here. Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh, I'm gonna die. Fuck. Dead. Dead! Ah, shit. I'm roasted with sweet vibraries. Incoming dropship. There we go. And stay down. Nice heavy this should come in handy. Where, where, where are they? What less to worry about? Now you see me. Commander Shepard of the Normandy. I'm afraid I don't see any Quarian survivors here. Damn. Wait. 
Shepard. Inspector Tally worked with. Oh, I don't know why you're here, but right now any organic is a welcome sight. Patch your radio into channel 617 Theta. We were on a stealth mission, high risk. We found what we were after. The Geth found us. They've got us pinned down. Can't get to our ship. Can't transmit data through the solar radiation. Oh my god, fine, I will go back. I'm sorry, I forgot, I died. <sighs> What's the status of your team? How many of you are left? We were a small squad, dozen Marines plus the science team. We're down to half strength now. Made the synthetic bastards pay for it, though. What brought you this deep into Geth-controlled space? You're asking the wrong person, Shepard. I just point the shoot. Something about the sun. It's going bad faster than it should. Some kind of energy problem. Any idea where the Geth came from? One of their patrol ships found us. Drop ships started raining Geth down on our heads before we could get off the world. Systems under Geth control. We knew they made planetary sweeps periodically. We hoped going low emissions would hide us. Do we have to worry about the Geth sending in reinforcements? I don't think so. Their patrol ship hasn't lifted off again. The radiation blocks all off-world communication. How are you holding up? We can be there in a few minutes. Take it slow and careful. Direct sunlight fries your shields all to hell. We're bunkered down at base camp across the valley. I left Tally Zora at a secure shelter, then doubled back to hold the choke point. Getting Tally out safely is our top priority. If you can extract her, we'll keep him off you. <coughs> confirmation that the Geth <coughs> hasn't reached Tally yet? Affirmative. Left my best men with her. When you get here, you can talk to her on the comm. Every Marine on this rock is sworn to protect Tally Zora. Long as one of us is still drawing air, she'll be safe. Really? Hold position. We'll hit their back ranks. Wait, watch your ass. We got a drop ship coming in. All right, so you said behind? Can I go back? I don't know if I can go back yet. the area and located the demolition charges the core you mentioned. Put it on my radar. Done. You will need both sets of charges to clear the rubble. I don't know if I can go back. Nope. It's gone forever. Oh well. Um, didn't they have like bombs or some shit? Grenades. Yeah. What left to worry about? Well, that shit. Whatever. We need a core sample to get a timeline on the rate of radiation increase, but our equipment keeps dying on us. Shepard once used a mining laser to clear some rubble back on Therum. Maybe I can do something similar with demolition charges. I don't remember that.
got hostile drone. Going dark. Yeah, I, I know, it's been a while, I don't, <laughs> I don't really remember. She's fine. Nah, he doesn't care. He's just happy that I'm playing. I sidestepped that. Nice. No, get around the other way. Charges are go. Move it or lose it. which submachine gun acquired. The following squad members are now able to use this. Alright. Hold on, I think we're back here. Ah, shit. Well, I was gonna go back in and get that other thing, but I can't now. So I'm stuck in here. Fuck. Alright, whatever. Orion architecture. There's two words you don't expect to hear together. This deep behind get lines? Hope the Quarians got what they were looking for. Small function, please request remote door activation. Hello? Is anyone there? 
Tally, it's Shepard. Shepard? Uh, I'm not complaining, but you show up at the strangest times. What are you doing in the middle of Get Space? I was in the neighborhood. I thought you might need a hand. Thanks for coming, Shepard. It means a lot to hear your voice. Carl Rieger and what's left of the Marines got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. I got the data I needed and I'm safer now, but I've got a lot of Geth outside. What is this research you're after? It's about this world's sun. It's aging faster than it should. I can tell you more about it once we've got fewer Geth shooting at us. Would it help if I brought in the Normandy? Doubtful. These buildings are centuries old. If you bring down heavy fire, this whole place could collapse on us. Is anyone else still with you, or are you alone out there? Rieger had a team of Marines covering me when I ran for the observatory. At least some of them are still alive. I can hear them firing at the Geth outside. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the Geth, and the console's damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. Should be unlocked now. Be careful, Shepard, and please, do what you can to keep Rieger alive. They've seen us. Those drones have optical ah, camouflage shit. systems. shit. Stay frosty. Did I do that? Yeah. Beautiful. There we go. Ha! Eat it. Ah! Ah! Dad. Damn it! <laughs> All right, fine. I just gotta finish this. This. We got it. We got it. Been spotted. Those drones have optical camouflage systems. Stay frosty. Ah! <laughs> yeah, ladder for cover. Did I do that? There we go. Down you go. Beautiful. Taking oh. ah! ah! fire. Oh. What the? Don't worry about. Perfect. Damn it. You know. Damn it. There we go. Fucker. Nice. Down you 
Okay. That's not good. Get down. Ah, definitely like old times. He seems like almost excited. Oh, Rieger. Over here! Get to cover! Squad leader Cal Rieger, Migrant Fleet Marines. We talked on the radio before that dropship arrived. I still got no idea why you're here. This ain't the time to be picky. Callie's inside over there. Jeff killed the rest of my squad, and they're trying to get to her. Best I've been able to do is draw their attention. Are you sure she's still alive? The observatory is reinforced. Even the Geth will need time to get through it. <laughs> and it's hard to hack a door when someone's firing rockets at you. The Geth are near platoon strength, but the Colossus is the worst part. It's got a repair protocol. Huddles up and fixes itself. I can't get a clear shot while it's down like that. I tried to move in closer, but one of the bastards punched a shot clean through my suit. How bad is your suit damage? Combat seals clamp down to isolate contamination, and I'm swimming in antibiotics. The Geth might get me, but I'm not gonna die from an infection in the middle of a battle that's just insulting. What can you tell me about the battlefield? Right side's got a catwalk with a sniper perch. You can wreak some havoc from there, but none of my men made it past the Geth. Middle's got cover, but the damn Colossus has a clear shot at you the whole time, and you've got Geth coming in from both sides. The left gives you some cover from the Colossus, but your ass is hanging out for the Geth. That's how I got shot. Any ideas on how to deal with the Colossus? Standard protocol with armature class units is to sabotage the shields and whittle it down, you know? Kill it with bug bites. But the repair protocol blows that plan to hell. You try to wear it down, it just huddles up and fixes itself. So whatever we do, has to scrap that bastard fast. Probably means getting up close, past that cover. We need to get to Tally. Got any ideas? Just one. I'm not moving so well, but I can still pull a trigger. I got a rocket launcher that the sun hasn't fried yet. You move in close. I'll keep the Colossus busy, maybe even drop its shields. With luck, you'll be able to finish it off. Good luck, Rieger. Let's go shoot some gas. Give us a lie. <laughs> It's true. Hostile. What's that to work? Hurry about. And is nice. Ah. All right, fine. Fuck it. Ow.
Not going well. No. <sighs> Fuck. Dead. <sighs> I killed it and then I died. <sighs> I gotta finish this up because I gotta. So people are calling me and I gotta. I gotta. I gotta deal with this stuff. Good luck, Rieger. Let's go shoot some gas. <sighs> All right, come on, come on. Enemies ahead. How about you stop get you get up off, off my case? into oh
Yeah, my carrots, I can't see! Alright, there we go. We took them. never have made it out of this room. This whole mission has been a disaster. I wish I'd joined you back on Freedom's Progress, but I couldn't let anyone take my place on something this risky. A lot of Quarians lost their lives here. Was it worth it? I don't know, Shepard. It wasn't my call. The Admiralty Board believed the information here was worth sacrificing all our lives for. I have to believe that they know what's best. I didn't ask what some admiral thought. I asked what you thought. A lot of people died here. Some of them were my friends. All of them were good at their jobs. That damn data better be worth it. The price was too high. What can you tell me about your research here? Haystrom's sun is destabilizing. Back when this was a Quarian colony, it was a normal star. It shouldn't change that quickly. Any idea what's destabilizing the sun? If I had to guess, I'd say that it was dark energy affecting the interior of the star. The effect is similar to when stars blow off mass to enter a red giant phase. But Haystrom's son is far too young for this to be natural. I don't know if he died. I hope he didn't. Whatever the reason, I'm glad I could help. Once you deliver that data, I could use you on the Normandy. I promised to see this mission through. I did. I can leave with you and send the data to the fleet. And if the admirals have a problem with it, they can go to hell. I just watched the rest of my team die. Maybe not the whole rest of your team, ma'am. Rieger, you made it. Your old captain's as good as you said. Damn Colossus never stood a chance. If need be, the Normandy can get you out of here, Rieger. Well, the Geth didn't damage our ship. As long as we get out of here before reinforcements show up, we'll be fine. Actually, I won't be going with you. I'm joining Commander Shepard. I'll pass the data to the Admiralty Board and let them know what happened. She's all yours now, Shepard. Keep her safe. All right. A uh, submachine gun. Yeah, I don't know if I got all that stuff. All right. Cerberus saw footage of you in action, Talizora. We're looking forward to having you on the team. Your engineering expertise will really benefit the mission. I don't know who you are, but Cerberus threatened the security of the migrant fleet. Don't make nice. That's why you're here, Tally. I need people who aren't Cerberus. People I can trust. I wasn't part of what happened to the migrant fleet. But I understand your distrust. I hope we'll get past that as we work together. I assumed that you were undercover, Shepard. Maybe even planning to blow Cerberus up. If that's the case, I'll loan you a grenade. Otherwise, I'm here for you, not for them. It's all I'm asking, Tally. Remember, Shepard, these people thought enslaving Thorian creepers and Rachni was a good idea. I'll be in engineering. Don't forget to introduce yourself to Edie, the ship's new artificial intelligence. All right. Uh, let's go find Tally, talk to her, and then I think we're gonna call it. Is everybody and their mom is trying to get a hold of me today? Uh. Shepard, what can I do for you? 
Is the new Normandy giving you any trouble? Please, Shepard. I'm a quarium. Give me a chunk of scrap metal, a circuit board, and some element zero, and I'll have it making precision jumps. I was worried about working with Cerberus engineers, but they know what they're doing, and they've been very polite. How's the Normandy running? Say what you will about Cerberus. They know how to build ships. The Normandy's running even better than before. I don't know if it can stand up to a collector attack, though. I'm researching some ideas that might help. Have you got time to talk? We didn't really have time to chat while taking out Geth on Haystrom, did we? I can't believe so many people died. Thank you again for getting Rieger out alive. All for data about stars blowing up. I hope the Admiralty Board gets some use out of it. Have you heard any word about Cal Rieger? Did he survive his injuries? He sent me a message. It looks like he'll make a full recovery. Any time you get a suit puncture, it's a matter of luck. Rieger got out with a relatively minor infection. Hmm. Having any trouble settling back in on the Normandy? I like the quiet. I miss the old faces, though. Presley, Engineer Adams, all of them. It doesn't seem right having Cerberus in charge of this ship. Are you sure working for them is the right thing to do? Mm hmm. I don't think we have a choice. I don't like working with them any more than you do, but we need them. I know. Just watch yourself. You're their best weapon right now. But as soon as you no longer serve their needs, be ready for them to turn on you. For now, I should get back to work. Thanks for coming by. Alrighty then. to cough anymore you guys i've really Maybe done with it a new message at your oh, private yeah. terminal. fine i'll read that first no back transfer request approved admiralty board migrant fleet commander shepherd per telizora has or what what vas nemas that's her whole name i guess Request included with her data delivery from Haystrom. The Admiralty, Admiralty Board has approved her transfer to your command. She has been informed that additional duties to the migrant fleet may still be necessary on occasion, but has been given extended leeway to determine when her mission with you is considered complete. This choice was hers, but your role as de facto captain during the pil her pilgrimage may have caused her to be more susceptible to your requests. The Admir Admiralty Board trusts that you will treat her, your new crew member with the respect due and honor member of the fleet. Should any harm come to her due to your neg to, to negligence on your part, this board will take severe and appropriate action. All right, fine. All right, I gotta go. My phone is blowing up with text, so I'm gonna save here.